Hello, Mr. Kuldeep Yadav. Hearty congratulations on securing All India Rank 1 in Electronics and Communication Branch of Engineering in Engineering Service Examination 2021. Thank you. Uh, Kuldeep, getting qualified in the Engineering Service Examination is something good achievement. But getting All India First Rank is something extraordinary. So, so how do you feel now after securing this All India First Rank? Oh, feeling relaxed and happy. Okay, right. What was uh, your parents' reaction when you when they came to know about your rank? Uh, I was a little bit shocked. <laughs> your parents, your parents' reaction? Uh, same, sir. Same, right. <laughs> uh, Kuldeep, I once again congratulate you for getting such a uh, all India first rank. Uh, yes. uh, Kuldeep, please uh, share with us. Uh, uh, which type of coaching program that you have taken from our A Seeing Academy? Sir, uh, test series, I, I took test series, online test so, series. So you have availed a test series yes. from AS Academy. Yes. Apart from that, anything else? Test, uh, test series, interior guidance program? No, sir. Uh, right. So you have availed an online test series from AS Academy, right? Yes. Okay, good. Good, Kuldeep. Uh, Kuldeep, please uh, tell us, uh, especially in engineering service examination, practicing the question bank is very, very important. Yes. So how our ES Academy online test series helped you in your preparation as well as cracking the examination with all India first rank? Sir, I got a variety of questions of all the subjects and, and analysis was also very good. And okay. It helps me to keep revise the subjects. Okay. Uh, Kuldeep, in our online test series, uh, where you used to stand rank-wise? Sir, around under 10, I was. So, you're used to be, uh, you used to be always in the top 10. Yes. yes. Very good, uh, Kuldeep. Very good. Uh, Kuldeep, generally, what we have seen, the students who uh, prepare for the engineering service examination, they also appear this gate examination. Did you attend gate examination also this year? Uh, sir, I attempt, uh, but uh, I was not prepared well this time. But okay, I right, uh, so. previously, previous year I uh, was prepared better than this year. And in right. okay. gate 2021, I scored, uh, I secured around uh, 381 rank. Right. Okay. That good because your main focus is uh, engineering services. Engineering services. So that's it, right? Uh, All India first rank. <laughs> no more. Uh, no other examination you need to focus except other civil service exits are like, right? Right. Uh, Kuldeep, uh, because you are All India first ranker in electronics paper, so many aspirants of this series this examination, uh, they'll be looking at you, right? How you have prepared for prelims examination as well as mains examination. What was your approach, your strategy and all this. So, uh, I would like to ask you that up to your prelims examination, did you focus only on the prelims portion? Otherwise, apart from prelims, did you also prepare something mains portion also? Sir, I was uh, focused about prelims at that time. Right. So after prelims only, you have started the mains portion preparation. Yes, sir. Uh, I prepared ESC 2020 as well. And previously, I was, uh, I was not able to secure rank. But uh, that preparation helps me to... Yeah, that's yes. So in the ESC 2020, uh, up to what stage did you go there? At the uh, interview stage, I... So up to interview stage, you went there in 2020. Not successful. In 2021, R India first rank. Oh, yes. So that is extraordinary, uh, Kuldeep. Kuldeep, please tell us uh, what modification that you have carried out in the preparation? Because in 2020, you could call it, you couldn't get the any rank. In 21, all India first rank. So what changes you have made in the preparation? Sir, I was uh, I was uh, on more I was on more focus on revision. I kept revision. Yes. Uh, so revision plays a key role. So you got enough time to revise. Yes. And the revision made you this, uh, what you call, to be on the top, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, Kuldeep, normally, revision means, uh, did you prepare any short notes also for revision purpose? Otherwise, you used to revise the uh, long uh, descriptive notes only. 
sir i prepared a short notes of all the subjects and uh, keep revising at uh, regular intervals right uh, kuldeep uh, may i know about, about your educational background which college are you from sir i am from ambedkar institute of technology it is uh, situated in delhi in geeta colony it is under guru gobind singh indrabasti university okay when did you pass out on uh, 2016 i was passed out and then i gave gate and uh, joined bsnl as junior telecom officer and from there on i am working here only so you are working as a jto in the bsnl yeah in pune okay right very good you are still working now yes okay kuldeep that is something uh, right see while you, uh, working in an organization simultaneously preparing means uh, it involves a lot of uh, dedication isn't it uh, so what was the inspiration behind this uh, i was uh, it was uh, i want to achieve something big that's why i yes so your aim was uh, achieving something great yes. so that's why while doing the job also used to prepare simultaneously yes sir okay right uh, kuldeep uh, right in this uh, long journey of preparation i i can say long journey of preparation uh, how many hours you used to work daily on this esc preparation but around 8 uh, 8 hours so you used, used, used to prepare exclusively for the engineering service examination yes, 6 to 8 hours okay. 6 to 8 hours how you used to spend this 6 to 8 hours you used to study only one subject otherwise more than one subject at what interval you used to do yeah three, three to four subjects i was preparing simultaneously simultaneously right daily so at what interval you used to give a break when you were studying those subjects around sir it depends uh, if i am uh, interested in a subject then it will it will be a stretched or if uh, if i need break then i i will take around one and half hour right so, Okay, understand, Kuldeep. So, at what interval you used to give what you call the revision? Normally, people say that uh, daily revision, weekly revision, monthly revision, like that. So, what was your schedule of this revision? Well, whenever I feel uh, something is missing in a subject, then I revised. So, not any. So, you carry out revision, not with a specific uh, planning, like uh, by so and so date I have to do this revision. like that any planning no, unit no date specification i was right okay uh, good kuldeep see in the what to call electronics uh, there are many technical subjects right and particularly if you see the engineering service examination we have pair prelims one paper of dhanush study is also uh, can you please uh, tell us how did you prepare for this uh, prelims dhanush study subject there are 10 topics there Like uh, yes. ethics, ICT, current affairs, material science, quality management, like that. We have. Did you prepare all uh, the ten topics? Otherwise, any specific strategy that you have made on this? Sir, I used YouTube videos uh, and various uh, Google searches. I was and uh, revising previous year data. So the revising previous year data has. So did you prepare all the ten topics? Yes, sir. I prepared all the ten topics. Okay. So after watching these videos and the previous year's question bank, etc., did you prepare any uh, notes also on this uh, current general uh, studies topics? Yes, sir. I prepared my notes as well, and I used uh, some other material as well. Right. Good. Right. So you are equally perfect on all the ten topics of the general studies subject. Sir, most of the topics I prepared well. Okay. Good. 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 right see after uh, writing this prelims examination uh gs paper as a well technical paper how many marks uh, you were getting approximately when you were verified uh, key sir, around the coaching center around uh, 20 270 plus uh, i was getting uh how many marks in the general studies paper around 100 around 100 remaining 170 in the technical uh, paper uh, yes 170 yeah, right. or 180 hours uh, that is a good achievement uh, kuldeep uh, what about this uh, mains uh, papers two papers we had approximately how many marks that you were expecting from this each paper uh, i was 
i attempt well but i couldn't uh, calculate the marks right so you are very confident you would have got definitely good marks because i did a first time right <laughs> good great achievement uh, kuldeep uh, kuldeep one thing when it comes to the mains examination uh, many toppers say that uh, selection of questions and time management uh, these things play a crucial role in the mains examination so what you have done actually in that uh, mains examination how did you select the questions any strategy how did you take that sir uh, my strategy was uh, to attempt as many numerical as i can and with good accuracy right but we had some theory questions also right yeah theory theory uh, question also but uh, i was not uh, keen to put more time on theory because they eat some time yes sir so so but sometimes you can't escape because the questions order will be like that isn't yes, it sir. So, did you attempt new uh, numericals first or critical questions first? Uh, numerical first. Numerical first. In the last stage, you might have attempted the critical questions, right? Critical questions. Uh, Kuldeep, uh, did you attempt all the five questions in each paper? No, yes, sir. I attempt. Uh, I uh, left some parts, but I attempt all the five. So, almost all the topics you have attempted. Yes. Sir. Right. Uh, good. Uh, see. how did you maintain that accuracy and then the speed in this examination of mains because you require a lot of writing skills for the yes sir so how did you practice all those sir i was uh, practicing through case series and various previous year questions and various work books as well so you could have that good practice right right kuldeep uh, uh, see Uh, among your uh, various uh, technical subjects, right? We have some technical subjects in the paper one, and rest of the topic, and rest of the subjects in the paper two. If you see the paper one of uh, mains portion, uh, can you name two subjects which are highly scoring for you? Sir, uh, network network theory and uh, analog electronics are scoring. If you attempt well, pa paper one. So what about paper two? In paper two, if you have a good command and communication, then you can attempt most of the questions. Right. So, what was your case? As well as, well as the uh, electromagnetic theory. Okay, right. Who uh, did? Uh, did you refer any test book for your preparation? No, sir. I was. I have not much time. That's why. Right. So, okay. Who uh, did? so from your long journey in this engineering service examination preparation that to you are the all india first ranker in the ec uh, uh, can you share some tips for your uh, juniors as well as other aspirants of engineering service examination in general and electronics uh, students in particular uh, we should uh, we should uh, keep our concentration more on analog analog electronics and uh, Uh, communication system because uh, they are vast subjects and uh, uh, cover variety of questions in uh, paper one and paper two as well and we should uh, keep revising as much uh, we can right so anything else mm -hmm. so regarding the mains portion because to maintain that accuracy the speed time management all we have to practice anything? and uh, Keep revising yes. all the so practice is the key factor for that. Yes. Right, uh, good, Kuldeep. Kuldeep, uh, what are your parents? What sir? What are your parents? Parents, your father, mother, professions. Uh, sir, uh, my father has a small business. Right, mother. Uh, she is a housewife. Right, so they might have been very supportive. in our uh, preparation right <laughs> yeah so convey our wishes to your parents and your, your friends and all those who are part of your uh, success uh, mr kuldeep right okay i once again uh, congratulate you mr kuldeep for having achieved this all india first rank and we wish you all good luck in all your future endeavors
Thank you, sir.